Hey guys, it's me. And of course, I'm not on camera because I have another review to show you guys. And this is a review at 599fashion.com. And as you can see, it's another one of their gorgeous dresses. And this is a halter dress, which means in the back of this halter dress, there is no back to it. So I'm going to flip it around so you guys can see. It's a low back. And it's a halter, which is really, really pretty. As you can see, it's got the flower pattern there. And it's another pattern there. And then you've got a strip of fabric, which goes right across here. And then, of course, you've got a continuing flower pattern from the top all the way to the floor. And this is not a full-length dress. This is an actual one that goes a little bit above my knee, like about, oh, say, that much above my knee, but it's low in the back. So for you ladies who um, wear the strapless tank tops, underneath that would be a good idea um this is not one of those fashions that you could probably make modest i haven't found a top that you could put under it yet but i'm sure there's a way you can make it more modest like a little bolero jacket from 5.99 fashion i mean they just got their new stock in of the shugs so guys you've seen the purple shug of theirs so I would suggest you head over to 599 Fashion if you did like that. It's really light and airy. This is actually made extremely well. It's a thick fabric here, which is around the neckline, which as you can see on the hanger, it even comes tied in this cute little bow, <laughs> which they do for you. And then you've got the fabric that travels down, and it's in this gorgeous flower pattern which reminds me of an old-fashioned pattern. So for those people doing the vintage pinup, this would be an amazing, amazing dress for you with pin curls and stuff like that because of the flower pattern that it has and the, the reds, the yellow, the blue. And I don't know if you guys can see that yellow. See, this is like a really bright, bright yellow. And the camera fluctuates with the color. But it is a bright yellow. There it is. You can see it's a bright, gorgeous yellow. And then you have the blue and the red with the stripes with it. And that goes down as a pattern all the way on this side. And then on this side, you have the full pattern of the flower. And then it travels. This actual travels with the design inverted, which means it's white and blue here. It'll be blue and white on the other, like a stamp there. And then, of course, you have the red with the yellow and the white. And then you have the blue and the yellow and the red. And then the yellow and the red with the white on the outside. And it inverts each different pattern all the way down this dress, which is gorgeous. So the blue turns into red here and then goes down. And then you have, of course, the red here and the blue here. Now I'm going to show you the stitching on this because you're looking at this fabric. And this fabric is really, really light. And as you can see, I don't know if you guys can see that really, really clear. But the stitching is amazing on these, just amazing. I don't know how 599 Fashion does it. And I mean, this dress looks like if... You're standing there. When it's on the hanger, it actually looks like it's longer in the back than it is in the front, which is untrue. It is all the same all the way around. So the stitching on this, and I'm going to get this to flip so we can take a look at the stitching on this side. And as you can tell, the stitching on this side, I'm going to pull my finger into a color here so you can see the stitching real well. It is a nice stitch. It doesn't even look like it's been machined. It looks like a hand stitch. Now, this dress is actually very light and airy and movable. And it moves with you. It doesn't stick. 
and I have yet to see another one like these. I mean, 599 Fashion has them come in, and they go out just as fast. So be forewarned, if you see this dress now and you don't get it, it's probably because they already sold out of it. So nine times out of ten, they sold out. Now, here is the actual seam of this dress. I wanted you guys to see that. Because sometimes a seam looks strange when it's sewn. But this one, I'm going to bring the dress down to me so you guys can see this. But, yeah, this seam here. And I wanted to show you guys this because sometimes on a seam, you can actually see how bad a stitching is if the fabric's pulled anywhere. Now I'm running my finger up the seam for any bubbles or pulls in the fabric and there are none. Nothing. No bubbles, no pulls in the fabric, nothing. Not at all. Okay? So this is the dress from 599 Fashion and this dress is just completely gorgeous. So, there's the front again, and there's the bottom to the dress. That's the flower pattern that I was talking about, and it inverts to blue, and then you have the red, and then you have up here has the white and the blue patterns, which is completely, completely gorgeous, and I'm going to drop this down a bit on the hanger here, so... I could spin it around for you guys, and we could take a look at the back. Now, here is the chest area of this dress, and I got a fuzzy on it. Now I'm going to show you, this looks like it's more than one piece, which is unusual for a company to do. <clears throat> Usually companies do not do this. They do not put a seam in the chest area. And there's a reason that they don't, which I don't understand because of how light this fabric is, you really need to double up and put a screen or another piece of fabric in there so you can't see through in this area. Okay? I don't know about you, but I don't want anybody seeing through on this particular area in the chest area. So 599 Fashion has actually put a seam here. And, you know, this is the strap, which goes all the way up. And then there's the seam, which has another piece of fabric here, all the way down the chest area. And it's on both sides, which they've done. Okay? As you can see. And they have the seam here, which I'm going to try and get you guys a closer look with my hand in the way. So you could see the seam. Now, it's not unraveling or fraying or anything like that. It's a beautiful seam, front and back. It has a gorgeous stitching in it. So I don't know if you could see the crisscross pattern. And then it goes all the way down to here. This is a separate piece. And it doesn't even look like it, but it is a whole separate piece. And then it's dropped to the dress. Which is why in the front you have this piece of fabric. It separates the top chest area from the actual skirt of the dress. So, what do I have to say about this dress? Well... I looked at the tag of this dress, and this dress is from $5.99 Fashion, and believe it or not, it's from Torrid Company, okay? Yes, it's made in China, <laughs> and it's 97% cotton and 3% spandex, and it is a size 18, okay, which is a little bit big on me. Um which is strange because normally an 18 was not big on me. It is now big on me. So here's another feature which I wanted to show you guys real quick. 
there's a zipper here. And I don't have it zipped all the way up, but it zips all the way down to about here. Okay? So it goes all the way up to the back where the chest area ends, all the way down there. Okay? That's just in case, you know, you get one that's really, really too, too tight and you want to get into it. Now, this is stretchy material here, okay? So it fits snug, or at least it's supposed to. I have to get the right size. <laughs> and, of course, I have my string all over because it was in my closet, so it's picking up, you know, little tiny strings from my other clothes that it was too close to, which I don't normally do. And on the other side is the stitching as well in the chest area. And then you have the chest area stitching, which is right on the bottom. And then you have the V that goes up. So really, this is one of those vintage pinup dresses. And I'm going to back up so you guys can see this. This is a vintage pinup dress. And this is by 599fashion.com. It's the numbers 599fashion.com. Dot com, just in case you guys wanted to check it out. Um, they have new inventory stock, and so don't be surprised if this dress right here is gone. Okay, so don't be surprised because they have new inventory stock every single week. Sometimes they have it every single day. It depends on how fast these actually sell out. So I wanted to give you guys a heads up, and this is the dress that we're reviewing today. And this is the last product that we're actually reviewing from 599 Fashion. So I would like to take the time to thank 599 Fashion for letting us check out their products and letting us check out their website. They've been more than patient and kind with us. Their customer service has been amazing. Their PR department is beyond phenomenal. They actually have been more than helpful. Um, it took me a while to figure out which stuff that I wanted to review because, of course, I had an issue with choosing things and I didn't know what I wanted. And, well, it's coming. it was supposed to be coming into the time of year where I'd be able to wear these dresses and take photos, but sadly, Mother Nature has decided that she wanted to keep it cold. So... We may never get to see me in these dresses. So, that's about it. If you like the dress, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe because you never know when I'll be on my channel with the next company. And we've got more reviews coming up, so don't forget to check out 599 Fashion. I'm going to link it at the bottom, and I probably will put it up here somewhere at the top a link or something like about that big probably up here so it might be right there or it might be right there it depends but it'll always be down there so there's the dress once again and that is from 599fashion.com check them out give them a look see like i said they got their new shugs in and they're gorgeous, just like all of their stock. And remember, they do have free returns. So if it doesn't fit, all you do is notify them. They are really quick in responding. So, guys, enjoy. Check them out, and I'll see you guys again. Love you guys. Bye.